9. Careful and popular, but not wasteful. Lesson 3. Don't be wasteful on page 74 and 75. Before that, تعليمات وزارة الصحة. لبس الكمامة في الأماكن المزدحمة. وأيضا البسة إذا كنت تعاني من العطاس أو الكحة. غسل اليدين لمدة لا تقل عن 40 ثانية. أيضا استخدام المنديل وهي من آداب العطاس والكحة. تجنب التجمعات قدر المستطاع التي تتجاوز عن 50 شخص. وأيضا stay on your home. ابقى في منزلك. We will start our lesson. Unit 9. Careful and popular, but not wasteful. We are here listening three. Don't be wasteful. We will listen to a track, track number 60. Look at the picture and answer the question before we listen to the track. Who is in the picture? Who is there? Who is in the picture? We already have Omar. We already have uh, Fahad. We already have Fred. And we have two another. We already take them on unit seven and unit six. They are Yasir and Rakan. Who is in the picture? Yasir and Rakan and their teacher. So who is in the picture? We have Yasir and Rakan in the picture. Why isn't Omar there? Why is Omar not there in the picture? If you remember, Omar, where, where is Omar? He's already on the international school. Where is the international, international school? In Oxford. He is in Oxford. In England. What is the teacher talking about? Let's check. Climate. Safe energy. So it's be the climate. If we check to the picture, we have here the word climate. Safe. And safe what? If we go here, climate change, energy, we will have the energy downstairs. And so we will write climate change. They're talking about the climate change. The climate change. Now, we're going to listen to the teacher and number his question in the correct order. From A to E. A, B, C, D, E. And we will listen to the track and we will number the question that he asked his student on in the correct order. Let's listen. Lesson three. Don't be wasteful. Track 59, exercise 1. Look, say, and listen. A few months ago, we talked about International Climate Study Week. What can you remember about the lesson? Yes, Rakan. We're driving too many cars. Good. Yasser? We're using too much electricity. Excellent. And what happens if we drive cars and use electricity? Teacher, please. Okay, Rakan, you answer. We produce carbon dioxide and it rises into the air above the earth. Yes, you're right. The carbon dioxide rises into the air above the earth. And is that good or bad for the earth, Yasser? It's bad for the earth, teacher. Uh, why is it bad, Rakan? The Earth's heat cannot escape. Yes, and? This heat causes our climate to change. Very good indeed. So, my next question is this. What will happen if we don't stop climate change? Yes, Rakan. If we don't stop climate change, we may cause problems in the future. So, the last question is, what will happen if we don't stop climate change? So if I'm going to organize the number the, of the question, the last one will be what, what, what will happen if we don't stop climate change? If we write the question in the question, from the point of the number, it will be number 5, who what will happen if we don't stop climate change? But what is the first question? When you hear the track, the first question was, what can you remember about the lesson? 
the first question was what can you remember about the lesson so here will be number one what can you remember about the about the lesson the second question is about what happens when we drive cars and use electricity that's will be number two what is the number three is it is that good or bad for the earth well or why is it bad I'm still I'm not asking about why I'm asking about is that good or bad what's the advantage and the disadvantage for it what is it that good or bad for the earth here will be number three then I have two question what will happen if we don't stop climate change and why is it bad we will ask about why then we will ask then we will ask about what will happen if we do that and, and if we don't do it to stop the climate change so here will be number four why is it bad and the last one what will happen if we don't stop climate change which will be number five this is the number for the questions now you will listen again and number it with it check here organize it the number uh, the question and number the lesson question. three don't be wasteful track 59 exercise one look say and listen a few months ago we talked about international climate study week what can you remember about the lesson we first ask what can you remember about the lesson yes rakan we're driving too many cars good yasa we're using too much electricity excellent and what happens if we drive cars and use electricity now the, uh, the teacher asking question what happens when we drive cars and use electricity which will be number two T. teacher please okay Rakan, you answer we produce carbon dioxide and it rises into the air above the earth yes you're right the carbon dioxide rises into the air above the earth and is that good or bad for the earth yes sir? good for the bad earth it's, it's bad number three for the earth teacher uh, why is it bad, Rakan? Why is it bad? The Number Earth's four. The heat cannot escape. Yes, and? This heat causes our climate to change. Very good indeed. So, my next question is this. The last question. What will happen if we don't stop climate change? Which is <laughs> number five. Now, they organize the number for the correct order. The first one, wh what can you remember about the lesson? The second one, what happens when we drive cars and use electricity? The th uh, third one, is that good or bad for the earth? Number four is, why is it bad? And the last one, what will happen if we don't stop climate change? Then, read and match the heading, uh, a heading to a paragraph write the correct number in each box i have a to d a b c d and i have four and four names or names for the four that are here we will read the stories the paragraph the small paragraphs and we will put the number for the correct box here اللي بيكون التعريف المناسب لكل paragraph نحن نضع عندها الرقم المناسب كمثال make energy in a clean way energy from the sun energy from moving air don't waste energy let's check number one vision 2030 is the government plan for the future of saudi arabia it explains how the country is going to develop between now and 20 and 30. one important part of that plan is to help people use less use less water and less electricity we live in a hot dry country so we use a lot of energy to produce water and to keep us cool we shouldn't be wasteful if we use water and electricity carefully we will save energy and help the environment the second paragraph vision 2030 means we will produce more clean energy 
This helps to stop climate change. If we produce energy in this way, no carbon dioxide will escape into the air. air. Number three, this is a wind turbine. What, when the wind blows, the turbine turns and produces electricity. Of course, if the wind stops, the wind turbine won't produce any electricity. Number four, this is a solar panel. The solar panel. <coughs> when the sun shines on it, it heats the water in the pipes for the house at night or if the weather is cloudy, the water will cool. That's because the sun isn't shining on it. Let's take the first, the easy one. We have here energy from the sun. Where is the sun and where is the, uh, the letter here, the suns, the word suns and the energy for it, energy from the sun. Let's see, here we have the sun, uh, solar panel and when the sun shines on it. So we are talking about the sun here. So number four will be here because the word sun. And let's look for the moving air. Where is the moving air? The wind blows, the turbine turns and produces electricity. Of course, if the wind stops, the wind turbine won't produce electricity. Wind, air, air, hawa. Here will be number three. Then I have two. Don't waste energy. Make energy in a clean way. Vision 3, vision, uh, vision 20 and 30, Roy 20 and 13, means we will produce more clean energy. Clean way, make energy. This helps to stop climate change. If we produce energy in this way, no carbon dioxide will escape into the earth air. So, Roy 20 and 13, tani, we will produce more clean energy. Rah, rah nazid al-taqa. راح تكون الطاقة نظيفة ما راح يكون في أي تلوث للطقس تلوث للبيئة the environment the whole environment so make energy in a clean way here will be number two and the don't waste energy will be number one وهي رؤية عشرين ثلاثين وهي عدم إضاعة الطاقة then write down the answers a make energy in a clean way number two b energy from the sun will be number four and C, energy from moving air will be number three. D, don't waste energy will be number one. Then we will continue to our last question. We have ask and answer. We have from one to six. What is vision 2030? Why does Saudi Arabia need to use a lot of energy? Why should we use water and electricity carefully? Why is it a good idea to have clean energy? Five, what are the names of the objects in picture A and B? Six, what are their advantage and disadvantage? Let's take, take them. We are here, lesson three, don't be wasteful. The sixth question we have, what is vision 2030? Vision, the answer is here. You can take a picture. This is the answers. The first question, what is the vision 2030? No, the answer, vision 2030 is the government plan for the future of Saudi Arabia. ما هي رؤية 2030 رؤية 2030 هي خطة الحكومة لمستقبل السعودية حفظ الله بلادنا يا رب العالمين Second question Why does Saudi Arabia need to use a lot of energy لماذا تحتاج السعودية استخدام الكثير من الطاقة The answer Because we live in a hot and dry country لأننا نعيش في بلد نعلم الحرارة وأيضا الجفاف That's why we need to, uh, to use a lot of energy for it Question number three, why should we use water and electricity carefully? لماذا يجب علينا استخدام الماء والكهرباء بعناية? The answer to save energy, للحفاظ على الطاقة. Question four, why is it a good idea to have a clean energy? The answer to help stop climate change, لإيقاف للمساعدة في إيقاف اختلاف البيئة والطقس. Question five, what are the names of the objects in picture A? And B, we already write here a solar panel, and a wind turbine, turbine. If we back to the pictures, 
If we back here, this is the solar panel and this is the wind turbine. وهي محركات الرياح وأيضا هنا اللوح الشمسي. Then we will back to the questions. Number six. What are their advantages and disadvantages? When the sun shines on it, the solar panel heats the water in the pipes for the house. This is the advantage. هذا من الإيجابيات. من السلبيات. But at night or if the weather is cloudy, كان الجو غائم, it won't. ما راح تكون استخدام الشمس إذا كان الجو غائم. ما نقدر نستخدم اللوح الشمسي. The second one, when the wind blows. The wind turbine turns and produces electricity. And that the wind turbine and 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 the wind from one to six. Depends on the paragraphs from one to four. And thank you very much for your listening.